long-awaited tutorial of how I use AI in nursing school. I am so sorry it took me this long, but here I am trying to make a tutorial that is easy to follow along. So first and foremost, you're going to go to Notebook LM. Make sure to like, save this for later, and comment. I'd love to know where you're at, and if this is helpful, let me know if you have any other questions. This is the basics of how to upload your sources, as I'm showing you all the different places that you can add sources from. In the remainder of this video, I'm going to get really, really deep into the nitty-gritty of what this AI tool can do for you and how it can really leverage your studying time. So make sure to continue watching. Put it in two times speed if you think it's a little too slow. Super excited to show you this amazing AI feature. So this is Notebook LM. It's free. It's free AI through Google. It is really, really cool. And as you can see I've been using it for quite some time. Now I'm not going to show you my exact notes or anything because that is the property of the school that I go to but I will show you kind of sort of how to how to work this thing. So first and foremost everything that you see on the left hand side right here are YouTube videos. Any YouTube video that has a transcript can pick up the transcript take the information from the video and then use it in whatever you're asking it to do. Now if you don't know whether or not the YouTube video that you're using has a transcript, don't worry about it, upload it, it will tell you, it'll give you a red alert and it'll say, hey, we can't use this, it doesn't have a transcript. Usually what I do is I upload everything that the instructors give to us through either Blackboard or Canvas. So I upload the information page, which is where we have our student learning outcomes. I'll upload the PDF version of the PowerPoint. Just as a side note, it will only take PDFs. It will not take Word documents or PowerPoint. So you will have to convert those over. And if you don't know how to do that and you're in my nursing program, let me know and I will show you. And then anything supplemental that they give me. And then this is what I like to do. Here's the prompt that I like to type in. As you can see, my prompt says, please create 10 NCLEX style exam questions based off the student learning outcomes and sources provided. Please create a separate answer key with rationale. And it's going to think and think and think for a minute because I have extremely cheap Wi-Fi and it doesn't work all the time. So we're going to wait on that. While we're waiting for its response, if you go here, you can load a conversation that will literally talk you through everything going on here. All right, everyone, get ready. We're going deep into the world of labor and delivery today. Oh, exciting. You guys gave us a ton of material to work with. Yeah. Tell me that is not just the coolest thing. I love AI and I love AI for healthcare. Okay, back to view chat. Look at this. 10 NCLEX style questions based off of the student learning outcomes and a separate answer key with rationale. And I just tested this out yesterday and I am in love with it. I took all of the textbook readings that we were assigned that's like 100 plus pages, screenshotted them, put them into a PDF file, and then pulled and dropped them in here. And I'm gonna show you what it created. I actually printed it out. This is not the coolest thing ever. So it took all of the stuff from the textbook, it condensed it into a study guide that's comprehensive, goes over basic stuff that was explained, has it in such a neat way. And again, I would like to reiterate that this is all free. Like Notebook LM is through Google and at the moment it's free. I will say it is being beta tested still. It's kind of fresh, it's kind of new for AI, and there are some things that don't work, like you can't share with your classmates, unfortunately, unless you download the PDF or like put it into a Word document and send it to them, but you can't send them the exact files, which is why I'm creating this, because I want everyone around me to succeed. You can ask it for study guides, you can ask it different questions, you can ask it for analogies or ways to remember certain things. You get a little focused podcast that you can listen to before the lecture, so that way you're kind of already ahead of the game. And just like any resource, this is absolutely incredible. I can't use just one resource alone, so I do also use Quizlet, and I will skim my textbook even though I have now just learned about doing it this way, which is so cool. If you have any other additional questions about AI for nursing students or Notebook LM or ChatGPT or whatever, please leave them below in the comments. I would love to help you guys out. This has been just such a game changer for me and gave me a lot of success on my first two exams. I did not use this resource for my third exam and I really, really wish I had because you can tell by the grade that I got. If you don't know me, my name is Kay. I'm a first semester, first year nursing student. I love to encourage other prospective and current nursing students to just keep going and that even though it's hard, it is worth it. If you like positive content like that, make sure to give me a like on this video. Save it for later so that you can come back and use it for your nursing program. And give me a follow because I'd love to see you stick around.